everybody we have a Halloween craft today and it's going to be a spider and we're going to make it out of what else a golf ball and what you'll need is a golf ball again use um, you know an old golf ball don't use your husband's good ones um, a wire hanger now this one I've already cut up and I cut eight pieces that are about two inches in length and I took um, so you'll need wire cutters and I also then took pliers and I shaped them into an S. I just took the ends of um, of each of them and kind of made an S and those will be the legs. You need two Google eyes. You'll need a drill. Um, and the bit on here is pretty close to the size of what the hanger is and then um, it'll slip in pretty tight. I will take a little bit of well bond glue and put it into, um, put just dip the edges of the legs into there um, before I insert it just to give it a little more strength and then of course we'll need a little bit of glue for the eyes and some spray paint so this ball that I happen to be using today is a range ball and conveniently it has some stripes here so I'm going to just drill four holes on each side because the spider has eight legs um, and I'm just gonna you know kinda eyeball where they go but I have these stripes that will be my guide and I will do that and I'll show you how to insert the legs here it goes remember to put on your safety glasses safety first um, the can get a little bit hot when you do it so don't fret and if it seems like it's getting hot just turn off the drill and give it a little bit of time to cool off Okay, I have drilled all the holes. Now I'm just going to um, dip the ends of the legs into a little bit of the glue. Push it in there. Okay, I have inserted them all and sometimes I don't cut my feet quite right so they kind of point in weird directions but I don't mind that at all. Here he is. He's going to be standing. I'm going to position him as I would like for him to stand with his legs so that when that glue dries, it will be in the right place. If you have a shorter one, you might want to put that in the middle. Um, if you have one that turned out to be a little bit longer, you might want it on the end because then it can spread out a little bit more. All right, I like the way that's looking, and the legs can be any way you want them to be. Leave it to dry like that, and then um, once it's dry, you can spray paint it with the black paint, and then I'll be putting the googly eyes on, and I will show you the finished product. We are back. It's the next morning, and our spider has been completely um, spray painted and dried. And all we have to do now is put on the eyes. So I'm going to just no pun intended, eyeball, couple dots, put on my googly eyes, press it down, this glue dries clear so if there's a little bit that comes out it's no big deal. Here he is, cute Halloween decoration. Um, you could always add a little fuzz or something if you wanted to um, embellish a little further. But he, I think he's kind of cute. So, I hope you give it a try. Have fun with it. You could always put like an eye hook in here, paint that black also, and hang them. You could have a bunch of them hanging around. That would be cute too. Um, remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, and happy crafting. We'll see you next time. Bye.